Okay guys, here we go. It is part 6 of franchise mode for the Minnesota Twins. So, here we go. We got Scott Diamond versus Madison Bumgarner. I'm going to show you a couple changes I made. I didn't mean to say let me go. Uh, I signed Juan Pierre and sent down... Chris Parmley, that's who I sent down. And, you know, it's Juan Pierre. I sent him to a one-year deal, so no big deal. And, um... Kevin Correa got hurt, so Scott Diamond moves into the rotation. Brian Dunson's a long man, and Matt Garayers get calls backed up to be the middle man. And here we go now. Anyway, Madison, like, I want your, like, bum in my mouth. Gardner. Deep fly ball, right field! Pence back at the track! You can put on the board! Yes! Joe Mauer! No, just over the wall and right. And this time, off the glove! Booted a third infield single right now for Joe Mauer, it looks like, because you can't really give him an error on that one. And Madison Bumgarner is hurting. Looks a bit discomfort on the field. I don't know if they hit him in, hit him in the rib cage, they're saying. And uh, he's going to leave the game right now. And Dozier can't make the diving plays. Now Juan Pierre with the ball. Basically, if it's hit the left field, they're probably going to be going two bases on everything. And speaking of that, deep left center now. This one's going to roll to the wall. Into the gap now is Buxton. The throw into Dozier. The play at the plate. Not in time. That's an RBI double for Joaquin area. I'm going to make a play on it. But now the 0-1. And Pierre rips one back up the middle and past the diving glove of Arias. Pierre makes a big turn at first, but he will hold as Pagan gets the ball back in quickly. Pierre now getting a little bit of a bigger lead. Pierre is gone. The outside pitch, not even a chance to get Juan Pierre. Juan Pierre's first stolen base is a Minnesota twin. Now the cutter rolled out the second. Marco Scudero with the play, but Juan Pierre moves up to third as uh, three, four, and five are coming up now with one out. And the curveball lined back at someone. He's running around the bases now. He's just trying to stay alive out there. Mauer's going to head the second on the run down. He's tagged up between second and between third and home. And that was a nice play by the pitcher. But I can't remember if they threw it back to the catcher again. Mauer's going to be off. As the ball deflects about 35 feet up the line. Mauer's in there. Oh, I thought they weren't going to throw it. But, but Ploof now up to bat. Ploof now puts one in the left. Gregor Blanco coming on hard. They are going to say he trapped it into the glove. And that's an RBI single for Trevor Ploof. Hits a chopper. Off the mound comes Contos. And he throws it away down the right field line. Pence into the bullpen area to get it. Ploof gunning for two. The relay throw by Scooter not in time. I'm really confused why Scooter cut that off on us. Byron Buxton up now. Lays down a bunt. Perfect bunt on the third baseline. No play at third. The third of first. It's only pump faked by Contos. It is lined in the left to base hit. Ploof will score. Around second and back in there. Only making a turn is Buxton. A, I don't even think we have a lefty on our bench. And this one's hit through the hole and then the right. Around second and scoring is now Florimon. It's cut off. Thrown back in the second and Suzuki's in there. Or Dozier's in there. And lines one. Left field. Short hops into the glove of Blanco. And then it's Florimon. Third is Dozier. The pitch to Sanu. Slow roller out the shortstop. No play. No, they're going to try to go to second on it. As they wouldn't have had the two anyways. That's going to be a fielder's choice and an RBI for Miguel Sano. Six pitch at bat and he was 0-2 the entire way. But this one's going to be a three pitch at bat as the ball game's over. Glenn Perkins gets him with 96 at the letters. And uh, we advanced to 23-25 and 25 on the season. Juan Pierre played a nice game in his first game. Went uh, one for three, I believe. Either one for three or one for four. Did score a run and get an RBI, I believe. So... And uh, player of the game is Scott Diamond, who went six innings, allowed three hits, one run. One of them, it was obviously earned, and five strikeouts, giving up no walks or home runs. And uh, that's going to be the end of the video, guys. So uh, if you like the video so far, make sure to hit that like button. And uh, make sure to subscribe as well if you're new here. And um, make sure to comment down below if you uh, like this series.